Fovo Strait off New Zealand's rugged south coast, one of the most notorious waterways you'll find anywhere. Stabycraft Marine was born in these unforgiving seas of the Roaring Forties. It was the world's first aluminium positive buoyancy boat, dependable, rugged and virtually unsinkable, providing the ultimate in safety, stability and fuel economy. That was back in the mid-80s. Nowadays, boaties all over the globe swear by the boat that takes you there and back again, the Stabycraft. Working Australia's notorious southern coastline, the Australian Coast Guard know you can't always control the conditions. It's what you choose to put between you and the ocean that makes the difference. Whether out rescuing a stranded fisherman or towing a stricken boat to safety, they do it with peace of mind. They do it with a Stabycraft. It's not all hard work, whether you're miles offshore playing a game fish or water skiing, Stabycraft ensures an enhanced boating experience, so families, recreational boaties and the intrepid really can adventure with confidence. What began in 1987 with a single model has evolved into an extensive range. At the top is the all-weather luxury of the super cabs and pilot house models. Step aboard the all-new 829 Super Cab G3. Ultra slim, positive buoyancy tubes coupled with underfloor fuel tank mean a generous, uncluttered deck space with good access to the sides and plenty of rod holders. This superfish transom box with a large kill tank, bait board and extra rod holders is just one of three transom options offered on this model. Inside the cabin is a dedicated dinette and galley with a freshwater sink, two burner stove and fridge. There's also a comfy V-berth and head with privacy curtain. Put yourself in the driver's seat of a helm that combines comfort and practicality. Our XR Sport and Fisher models are mid-range boats, perfect for on-water family fun. Our Frontiers are versatile open boats for ultimate fishability that are also used as transport platforms in remote locations where rivers take the place of roads. I'm Matt Watson from the ITM Fishing Show. Well, uh, the first Stabie craft I, I chose, which is something a lot of people don't realise, is that it was long before I had any sort of sponsorship arrangement with Stabie Craft. Um, I was, you know, I had the whole marketplace to choose from and I sea trialled a lot of boats and in the end the two main factors was the safety, I was going a long way offshore and I wasn't as experienced then as I am now so that was very important to me and the positive buoyancy of the Stabie craft just makes them absolutely ideal for carrying a lot of load around and we are going to some pretty extreme locations um, catching some very big fish um, from relatively small boats. I've had uh, countless adventures uh, out of my Stabie craft, both my 659 and, and my little 389. But uh, probably the most exciting was when uh, we took the 389 out to catch a marlin on a hand line. Um, I wouldn't recommend taking on a fish like that in a small boat, anything other than a Stabie craft, because in effect um, I felt more comfortable 40 miles out off the coast in a little 389 than I have done in a lot of much bigger aluminium boats. Innovative design lies behind Stabycraft's success, and that's an ongoing process. Managing Director Paul Adams recalls the early days. Back in 1986, before Stabycraft Marine was actually formed, uh, I was uh, working for a company down in our local home port. Two of the local commercial fishermen came and approached us about building a pontoon boat. And that was late um, uh, 1986. And so, 87, we built a couple more sort of backyards, so to speak. And then, uh, May of 1987, we began Stabycraft. Yeah, the name Stabycraft uh, came from a lot of uh, 
uh, various versions of names regarding relating to the uh, to the sea and to boats and boating and such like. Stability, stable, uh, denoted everything about our product. So that's that's where it came from. So the feedback after the first few boats that we built was uh, was really really good. Commercial operators were enjoying it for its uh, load carrying capability and its strength and its uh, durability. And uh, that flowed on to uh, the recreational users who heard from the commercial users via word of mouth uh, that uh, we were producing a really great product as well. So uh, before we knew it, we were building quite a number of boats. Staby Crafts, from a woman's perspective, they really have a gentle ride, even in rough water. Um, a lot of boats that I've been on, they slam when they hit the waves. The Staby rides on top of the waves and it rides really, really smooth. I like that a lot. What I like about uh, Staby Craft is, number one, the safety factor. Um, our guests are self-guided, so they go out on their own and experience the Alaskan adventure, and they need to be safe. Um, Staby Crafts are they're safe. It's just that simple. Um, you can fill them with water and they won't roll over, they won't, you know, they're going to be safe and our guests feel really comfortable with that. Um, the other thing is the, the ride factor. Um, I was in six foot waves once with a, a 17 foot one. It was amazing. I mean, they just stay right up on top of the water so nice and don't hurt your back. It's amazing. You know, I just can't say enough about them. They're just great. Today, Stabycraft Marine is the largest trailer boat manufacturer in New Zealand exporting boats to Alaska and the west coast of the lower 48, Australia, New Caledonia and the Pacific Rim. You can't keep a good boat down, they say, or they should. We submit every Stabycraft prototype to rigorous positive buoyancy testing before putting the design into production. Watch in this control test of our 389 Fisher. As the boat fills with water, see how it naturally finds its own level. Once capacity is reached, the water starts flowing out over the transom. In this survey test, a 459 Fisher is loaded with 200 kilograms of weight and two adults, and still floats just as it was designed to when pumped full of water. Stabycraft boats are built to maintain their integrity, whatever the conditions, because we put the buoyancy in the best place possible, the upper, outer extremities of the boat. Our boats really are virtually unsinkable. In fact, every boat we build exceeds the toughest international flotation standards of New Zealand, Australia, Europe and the USA. So with Stabycraft Marine, you are in good hands. It's all about building the best bloody boats we can. To find out more about the world of Stabycraft positive buoyancy boats, visit us now at www.stabycraft.com.